Hey guys, Goku here, and welcome back to another installment of Goku Reacts. Today we are watching Dragon Ball r and Episode 2. I have been waiting for quite a while for this to upload. It's been quite a minute since I saw the first one, but it's still pretty fresh in my head. This is by Moscow X, that's right. The other me! Well, the... Uh, yeah, where's your own beat, but... Yeah, um... Yeah, guys, this is by Moscow X, so be sure to go check out the channel. As you know, link to the original video will be in the descriptions down below, so please go support the official release. And if you can, share this video, like, and subscribe to support the channel. Turn on those notifications so you know when I upload next. Now, without further ado, let's get into this reaction, shall we? Here we go. Alright. Oh, there's that classic intro. Dragon Ball or in R. Neat. I wonder how much, how much time it took to make this animation. Very puffy, puffy animation. I look good, my bro Reddit. Watch is a thing. That's what I remember correctly. And all these fusions. Oh man! Me and my son, Goten, and Raditz and his daughter Ranch. I believe we're gonna see Gohan in this uh, episode, if I remember correctly. He was doing auditions for that. Oh, there's 18. Oh man! That dragon never seems to die, does he? For life. Rules for life. This episode is brought to you by BetterHelp. Convenient, affordable, and private online counseling available anytime and anywhere. Get started by going to tryonlinetherapy.com forward slash X and find warm yet professional advice today. This has there been a go. full day of adventures for Goten. And although his body rests, the young warrior's mind is just as active as ever. What's he thinking about? What are you thinking about, son? Are they gonna let us inside his mind? Huh? Come on, Goten, you can do this! <laughs> oh. Double Sunday! Oh! It sure is amazing. Wait, you want to learn the double Sunday? Final flash! And there's the Vegeta. So is he just thinking about all of us wow. and how cool we are? You know, Mr. Vegeta is scary. But I must admit, when he fights, he's really awesome. I wonder if Trunks and I could get to his level. Hey, how come I'm not here? I'm cool too. Uncle Raditz? Hey, Uncle Raditz! What are you waiting for? Let's do this. <laughs> Try not to mess this up, okay? Is he feeling lonely? Few but they're fusing and he's not a part of it. That's interesting. Interesting. Hey guys, wait up! I'm over here! Oh, I get it. I get it. Okay, I get it. Poor son. He's afraid of what? being left behind. What about me? There's me. Don't worry, son. You guys, what's going on? Wait. I'm here too. Can I just go with them? <laughs> Never say that to my son. I swear, go, go to him. I almost said Gohan. Oh Lord, I'm turning into the dream. Oh, for goodness sake! There's no need to shake him. But we're going to miss the best time of day for training. There's nothing like a Saiyan training session with my favorite nephew at sunrise. 
Well, your favorite nephew still needs to brush his teeth. Wait, wait, wait what about Gohan? Oh, yeah, the leggy kidnapped. See you, Goten. <laughs> I wonder what Gohan feels about that. <laughs> Is everything okay? I heard you talking in your sleep. Yeah, I'm okay, Mom. Was it a nightmare? Mom, really? I'm fine. <laughs> because you know Raditz and your dad will always keep us safe. Um, uh, Mom? Do you think I'm a lot like Dad? <laughs> well, looks weren't the only thing you inherited from your father. Well, hey, what's that supposed to mean? The I love Gohan's cut, expression. Goten's big decision. Oh. Do -do -do. <laughs> this is gonna be exciting. All right. Nice. Showing Uncle Raditz the moves. I like that. You know, this reminds me of something. I remember Gohan having problems with this getting up in the morning stuff. I must admit, you're really making your uncle proud. <sighs> Thanks, Uncle Raditz. Now all we need to do is ask Bulma to make you a cool new battle uniform, just like mine. Whoa, for real? Really? Yes, indeed. We don't Habitable need him wearing tank tops. I'm sorry, I just don't like the well, well, Let's have the. Let's have the. Uh... wearing it. So maybe it was a bad idea. Yeah, it is. <laughs> hey, it looks like a tank top. I'm sorry, I don't. I mean, I never no fancy that armor. Kiddo. But you and your dad wear the exact same clothes and have the same ridiculous mop on your heads. Who are you? Uh, how dare you? You're just jealous because I can do mine in Super you, Saiyan 3 that looks better that than look. yours. Or at the very least, something with your hair. His hair is fine. Know. My hair's always been like this, though. You know what, Goten? You are so lucky to be half Saiyan. I am? Why? Why, you can grow your hair, of course. Give it a few months and you can have a majestic mane, just like mine! <sighs> oh, here we go! Yeah. Every time. He always thinks he just has to outdo me. What's the matter, sweetie? All the time. Aren't you yeah. hungry? Mom? Could I get a haircut? No! Slug, come can. on! You have a fantastic fair, hair! Your hair has started to become quite messy. It's definitely due for a trim. Oh, you'll have to do more than that! Nothing can save that disaster! Hey! What do you mean? I resent that! I, I mean... <laughs> Maybe it's time for the boy to change his look up a bit. So he can be his own man. Look more menacing and less... Kakarot. Hey! Huh? What's wrong with looking like me? Seriously, well, what's wrong with looking like me? Having one Kakarot in this family. Now that's one thing we can agree on. You see, I'm making sense here. Um. Sweetie, don't worry. I Uncle really Raditz is think... easily the last person Ugh. to be giving out fashion advice. I'll cut your hair after dinner. But you've upset him. You know, Chi Chi, you really need to watch what you say. You upset Goten. Honestly. Go ten. <sighs> and so I'm thinking about getting a haircut. Okay, and? And? It's a big deal. My hair's always looked like this. What if I change it and it looks dumb? Dumb? What sort of cut were you thinking of? That's the thing. I don't know. I mean, long hair like Uncle Raditz's is cool and all, but that would take for Ever. Yeah, hey, well, you're not wrong. better than rocking your dad's hair, man. Hey! I'm not gonna lie, it's kind of weird. But isn't your hair the same as your mom's? Yeah! What? Yeah, no, yeah, no, I know no, you are not no, one no, talking. No, no, mom's hair is totally different. Totally, totally different, huh? Different. Uh, gee, uh, In what sorry. regard? I didn't mean to hurt your feelings. Yeah, <laughs> man, it's all so Yeah, my, my sense good. is weird. My hair is amazing! I gotta go do something. It's a symbol. Wait, trunks? You're on your own, man. <laughs> Don't let them get to you, son. Uh -huh. You look fantastic. Hmm. I'm surprised. Huh? And here I thought you were the least pathetic member of your family. But if you're letting some useless comments about your appearance affect you, you're beyond help. I'd hate to see how you'd cope if things got serious. Why are you here, Vegeta? So what should Shouldn't I you be go it, skulking or what are you looking at me for? rambling or something about how Reddit's how you're gonna but, beat Reddit's? Listen, kid. 
between you and I, you are the only hope for that sorry excuse of a Saiyan brood. Now is the time to toughen up. Be a proud Saiyan warrior. Define what you are and what it means to be a Super Saiyan legend. Follow in the footsteps of the Master. That's it! Yes, sir, Mr. Vegeta! Oh, Thanks. God, he's listening to Vegeta! This is not good. This is not good! This should be amusing. At least one of Kakarot's brats stands a chance of reaching their full potential. I the least he can do is really become a decent don't. punching bag for Trunks. You're monologuing again, Dad. Don't you have anything better to do, boy? Uh, uh, yes, Dad. Oh, he's the one to just... I can't even look at Vegeta. Where is Ron? Yeah, I was wondering, where is Ron? I haven't seen her. Where's Go Gohan? Hey guys, Masako X. Oh! Just a brief message for you. When I was younger, I suffered from bullying concerning my weight as well as my general appearance. For the most part, I had no one else other than my family to talk about this. Sometimes though, I just needed someone impartial just to talk this out and I never really got it. If better help had been around, I would have used its services in a heartbeat. It was just so necessary back in the day. I didn't know where else to turn. BetterHelp provides professional counselling which is accessible, affordable, and convenient. So anyone who struggles with life's challenges can get help, anytime, anywhere. 98% of users report significant progress after a few sessions, so go to tryonlinetherapy.com forward slash masakox and see for yourself. However, if you're in need of serious help immediately, I would suggest that you would seek alternative and direct organisations for advice. I'll leave links to said services in the description. Thank you for listening, and let's get back to part two. I kept it in because, quite frankly, it's, it's a good ad, guys. That's why I kept it in the video. I know it's just a hairstyle, but hear me out. Everyone is telling me I should change my look. I, I get that, but no one's really giving me any suggestions. Maybe you guys have some... Roshi and... Uh... <laughs> oh. <laughs> 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 We can say. No. Don't worry, Goten. Um, I completely understand you. Well, you do? Sure, uh, I do. I've been experimenting with my own look lately. Well, you're gonna grow your hair eventually. In my case, it turned out the original was always best. That's very nice of you. But you're gonna grow your hair in the future. Know where to begin. Really? <laughs> if I should. Listen, boy. I'm gonna tell you something I told your father many years ago. Oh? A lesson he should have kept close to his heart. Ladies. God. Excuse darn me. Darn it, Master I don't Roshi. I like where this is going. Neither do I. Well, young I know ladies going. simply love gentlemen with shiny young heads, if you know what I mean. God. <laughs> why? And you wonder why I didn't listen to you that much. Thank you for your advice, guys. Seriously, he uh, wonders Roshi, why I never listened to him that bye. much. Wait. Boy. Huh? You're not like your father, you know. I hope you find what you're looking for. Mm. Thank you. There he goes again at the last moment, dropping actual wisdom. See you around, little Goku. <laughs> Go Chen. <laughs> Thank you for just reaffirming. <laughs> yeah. Oh, there's Crunch. lunch. You're a girl, right? Last I checked. What's up? Do you know anything about haircuts? Oh, so you're actually going through with it. Yeah. Well, maybe. Well, I do remember the back side of your hair gets cut off. About it. So I'll avoid any cutting remarks. Wow. That, that's my expression. Say he is like me. That's my expression what? right there. Uh, so, do you know anything about haircuts? Jeez, tough crowd. Why are you asking me and not You're trying mom? too hard to be funny. Isn't she the one that cuts your hair? Well, I'm just afraid that when my mom cuts my hair again, it'll look the same as it always does. I gotta think of something. Anything. You can always ask my mom. She cuts my hair, and as you can see, it's pretty good. You think she would do that for me? Sure. You are family, after all. Come with me. I... Bye. Thank you! <laughs> he has my facial expressions. Just really. All right, I got you now. What? Mom. Uh -oh. Mom. Mom. Blonde much? 
What's up, kiddos? Goten has something to ask you. Go on, say it. Uh, launch? I... I would really like to change my look, but... I don't know where to start. Uh, what's wrong with the one you got? Uncle Raditz said I looked ridiculous. Oh, so that's what this is about, huh? Uh-oh! You in trouble, Raditz! Uh-oh! Give it a moment. Raditz! Get out here, you stupid oaf! Now! <laughs> oh, this is gonna be fun! Uh, what's with the shouting, woman? Woman? Who do you think you are, <laughs> Vegeta? Tear him a new nice one! to go to about what you said to him. About what? His hair, you dingus! You made fun of his hair! He's still upset about that? Listen, sorry about that, kiddo. Uh, it's okay, Uncle Raditz. I know you didn't mean it. I never thought you would get so worked up over it. Raditz! Uh -huh. snookums, it really does look Don't silly. Don't you snookums me, mister. We <laughs> didn't want to go to Goku and Chi Chi's place, and you are gonna apologize to everyone for being such an oaf. I Do love a lot of lunch. I really love really her. Don't think I have Do to. I? Make myself clear. <laughs> yeah, yes, yes. And you want Absolutely. see we Saiyans are always attracted on. to headstrong women. They can really keep our, they can keep us on our toes. Listen, Goten, it's nobody's business about what you look like. You like the hair you got. Fine. You want something different? Fine. Look at me, kid. Do I look like I give a crap what people think about me? Evidently uh, not. No. It's your decision, little man. Not your uncle's, not your mom's, or your dad's. It's yours. Hey, Raunch, why don't you fetch me that fashion magazine? I think I got an idea. Oh? Hey, Chi, brought your boy back home. <gasps> oh, thank goodness. You're just in time, Goten. I made your favorite, and we've got plenty for everyone if you want to see. I love how I'm remarkably dinner? been silent in mom? this episode. Could you cut my hair after dinner? Please? Of course. You have something in mind? I'm here too! You got it, kid. Alright. So, what do you huh. think? Hey, it's, it's not bad, actually. Hi. I like it. I, I like it too. To hmm. I don't know. It looks a bit like Yamcha now. Mm. One word. Well, I mean, it, he's got great You're hair. Why are you scared of bullets? Well, I guess he's scared of the one holding the bullet. Why don't we make God. a call to Gohan? Show him your new look. Yeah, he's not. Hey, bro. Gohan? <laughs> I almost didn't recognize you. I almost didn't recognize Gohan? you. Thanks. Your hair is slightly How's off. How's your conference well, in the sciencey stuff coming along? I hope you and Videl are eating well, honey. Hey, hey, Gohan. Hey, hey, Gohan. Well, to be honest, I'm quite busy at the moment. <laughs> I'm here. You know, my first Notice me. And there's a Notice lot me, cousin. <laughs> Videl's upset with me because I'm not getting enough sleep, apparently. Well, she's a wise girl. You should listen to her. She's kind of mean, though. Right, but then really again, sorry, but I need to why are we so attracted to these headstrong men? I'll call you later, okay? Bye, Bye son. Long, Talk soon. Bye, sweetie. Later. Go on. You know what, Goten? You look great. I shouldn't have tried to tell you otherwise before. As long as you're not wearing those ridiculous glasses your brother wears, <laughs> we'll be fine. <laughs> hey! I swear to call me. Relax. I'm joking. I still don't know what was wrong with the last do, but seriously, I'm glad you found something you're happy with. Yeah, son. Thanks, Dad. Really happy. Say, is it okay if I go ask Bulma to make me a set of armor like Uncle Raditz's too? Oh. Uh, sure. I'll give her a call right see, when we get back. Even, even Speaking other of which, me agrees. Come on, Raj. I really don't like the armor. More of your aunt and uncle's time. Can't you just wear the Raj, gi? I mean, come on. That's odd. It's a family tradition. Even go? Gohan. I don't know. Okay, he wore pickles. He wore mine, though. He wore Raj. my gi when he was younger. Raj! 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 Where are you, gal? <laughs> oh, she really is upset that Gohan didn't notice her. I didn't think it would hit her that that much. Piccolo? You lost, kid. Huh. 
interesting. Very, very interesting. I will say, I didn't get much screen time in this, but for the time that I got, I think I was utilized pretty solid. Trunks and Launch came more in the second half, and this is really a Goten heavy episode, which is fine. We got a little bit of Gohan, which is fine too. I have to say the highlight, honestly, was, was, um, was, with, Ron, was with Launch. Launch, I gotta say, us and us dating headstrong, independent, strong women, it fits our nature, obviously. With me with Chi Chi, Raditz with Launch, um, Vegeta with Boba, and Gohan with Miguel. Just, just strong women. That's what we say is do. We, we date strong women. Interesting. Now, I wonder what's gonna happen with, uh, with Launch and Piccolo. See you in Sneak peek. Woo! Hey, it's me, Goku! Hi! Well, Piccolo's there. Hmm, I wonder how he'll handle the situation, because Raj looks real sad. Yeah. Next time, on Dragon Ball r and R, a misunderstanding? Gohan's peace offering. Gohan's peace it. offering, nice. See ya! Well, as I said before, that was a fantastic episode. As I said before, like I was, I wasn't used too much in this episode, but overall, I really like this episode. I hope you enjoyed this too. Now, it wasn't as action-packed as the first one, so I won't say it's better, but I think the emotion in this episode was there. I really did. From the opening, from start to finish, Gohan just trying to find his identity and really wanting to establish himself as his own person. I really, really liked that with this episode, and um, I just enjoyed the uh, camaraderie of Gohan getting advice from everybody, even from Vegeta of all people. Vegeta! I mean, really, of all people, Vegeta to give advice. Yeah. But ultimately, it was Launch, who was the voice of reason, giving Gohan some sound advice, telling him that he shouldn't care what anybody thinks and should just Go with the flow and actually just decide for himself. You know, don't let nobody else keep you down. Roshi also gave a little bit of advice there, but I think it was ultimately Launch that was the real benefactor to Gohan in this episode. Also, I really was not expecting for Launch to get so hung up with Gohan, but then again, she really had, if, if my memory serves me correctly, she really was close to Gohan coming up because Gohan was like, Almost like a second father, like the really the real big brother to her coming up. So it's gonna be interesting to see how her and and what's gonna happen with her and Gohan. But yeah, guys, I really enjoyed this uh, episode, episode two of Dragon Ball Arnor. Fantastic! I hope to see more, and I hope you guys go check out the original video because the original link will be in the descriptions down below. Please, please go show your love and support. Go support Moscow X and all he does. I mean. He's part, he's half of me, or I'm half of him, or or each other. He's the other. Uh, you know what I mean, guys. I don't have to explain myself. Anyway, guys, I'll see you next time. All right. Take care of yourselves. Bye.